soap? Washing the light? Who? You know. Oh. She was not there. Not like you would even care if she was. Mind your tongue, boy! Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? I do not know my ways. I know it has not been easy. In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you. That's good to know. Really? So, should we go back to Midgard? Face the Black Breath? Or do you think there's more to see in this realm? It's sad the elves can't work things out. How if I'm such a beautiful place, but... War makes it ugly. You see with the eyes of a child. In war, a soldier sees beauty only in the blood of his enemy. The rest of him is lost. Sometimes never to return. You know about war, don't you? Wars are fought for two things. Survival or advantage. Battles may be won by the better soldier. You're back. I see you've been busy. Our observant. I am known for my attention to detail. You boys look like you're gearing up for quite the journey. There's an abandoned temple in Midgard that a fellow dwarf converted to his personal storeroom. Packed it with all sorts of treasures he collected during his travels throughout the realms. Throughout the realms? Which ones did he go to? What did he collect? Fafnir was a, shall we say, aggressive collector of magical artifacts. The more he acquired, the more he desired. There was no realm too dangerous, no relic too hazardous. He once ventured deep into Niflheim for a whetstone of all things. Huh. I bet that was quite the whetstone. Does this story have a point? Yes, it does. I just happen to have an entry stone to Fafnir's storeroom. You might find something useful in there. Neat. Thanks, Sindri. You're very welcome. Oh, and uh, if you find that whetstone, well, it sure would be nice of you to bring it to me. I'd advise caution if you're heading to the storeroom. Last I was there, all manner of nastiness had taken up residence. Won't your friend be upset if we steal all the stuff? Oh, <laughs> no. No, not at all. He's dead. I think. Oh. Poor Fafnir. There's a fine line between ambition and greed, you know. together. Father, I have a confession to make. All those voices in my head, well, this wasn't the first time. Back when we met Brock, his animal warned me about something hiding in the trees. That's why she didn't run across. She told you. Well, I could just feel what she was feeling, what she was afraid of. Hmm. It happens again. You tell me. Understand? Exist in the same spot. 
space, one on top of the other. It's like this room lets us travel without moving. came back from another realm, and we met your brother. Wait, not that over. Did you let that seed saw put hand to your blade? Hmm? You do know he lost his talent, right? Just up and left him one day. <laughs> Tried taking me down with him. Hmm. Did he botch up on a girl? Quite the opposite. Hell, even a blind pig farts up a truffle now and again. But you know what really counts? Consistency. And I got that coming out of all of my parts. What did you do? It's better. Good. Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. What is it, dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari, been working out in the Velander mines. Haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me, wears a fancy green ring. Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Fine. If you find Donvari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. You make up your mind? Do you remember the way back to the Black Breath? Of course. We need to walk across the bridge to the Vanaheim Tower. Are we going to the Black Breath, or exploring? Your choice. past that statue of Thor earlier, when we left the witch's place. And what direction is that? It's mid-morning, so there's so... Yeah. 
Focus up, boy. It's some kind of drawing. Maybe a map? Oh! Maybe a treasure map! Some statue. Who built it, you think? I do not know. I still can't read these. Oh look, the witch's magic is still covering those scorn poles. Saves us some time.
Sindri's Skyway card is still down there, if you don't feel like climbing. Father, do you... do you think I could carry her now? No. But I... I said no. Okay. So who do you think carved the face in the mountain? You would know better than I. Thanks. Now watch our step. Carelessness will only delay us. Right. Well, there's the black breath again. What do we do now? We see if the witch was right. It's working. She was right. Come. Let us finish this. Then we climb. You know, others said the giants used to visit the Midgard Mountains before they disappeared. Disappeared? Yeah, I guess they just up and left one day. No one knows why. Perhaps they returned to their home. Tiodenheim? Maybe. I wonder if the face in the mountain was a tribute to some important giant. The mouth! We made it! More black breath. did come here. Is that you? I don't remember stories of a giant with a deer head. I wonder who he is.
The floor boy. That doesn't mean anything. Something's missing. Think there's a second light crystal around here? Maybe the riddle will help. Nothing. What does it say? No yoked beast, nor fearful thrall, nor rooted tree doth know my call. Hmm. How do you think that got up there? Huh. This place must have been important to the giants. It's like they're testing us. Okay, that looks like right. Is it the answer? Freedom. Sure, that works. Go ahead. Sure. Rouse. What you doing? Oh, thought maybe there'd be a bridge. Huh. Your giants mean to test us further. There's a crystal in that torch holder. Should I light it? Fiesta! That helps, right? Oh. Oh. Guess we have to go down and go up. These passages seem too small for giants. <laughs> Why do you laugh? Oh, you're serious. I'm always serious. I forget. Mom always said you never took an interest in history. Giants are just grace. Elves and hold your fault. It doesn't mean they're big. What of the world serpent? Okay, in that case, giant also means big. But there's only one.
Boy, another light crystal. Just look at this place. It feels so... Dead. I was gonna say ancient, but it works too. Atreus, follow me. This is a lot of bodies. Tell me what you see. Well, they look like men, not giants. Correct. Be you seeking treasure. See the traps? Oh yeah. Lucky for us, they set them all off. Be grateful we stay dead.